morning guys welcome back to my channel it is saturday april 4th right now and we are still under quarantine it's been about two or three weeks now but we have a pretty busy day today so we've got some fun stuff planned things that we want to get done figured i'd take the camera with me and show you guys kind of what we're doing today bring a little bit of positivity to your day instead of constant madness surrounding our world so anyway we're gonna run some errands first off i'm gonna head downstairs and get some coffee because coffee needs to happen like now but i'll head downstairs and show you guys what i'm gonna grab for breakfast and things like that and then we'll get started with our day Okay, so now that coffee has happened, I'm gonna head upstairs and finish getting ready for the day so that we can head out and lots of fun stuff in store. So I'm gonna get my makeup done, get my hair done, and yeah, let's go. Walking on fire Trying not to bend my fate I'm tired of fighting Saying things we don't mean You know I don't like it When you're packing your back And turning your back Calling me a liar Okay, so I really quick wanted to show you guys This outfit of the day This is just like a cozy set um, From Target I think it is the brand A Star Above 
Um, but this is the cozy matching set that I've been getting a lot of questions on. So the top is really loose and flowy. And then the pants are more kind of like jogger style. So this is what we're going to be doing. Hair and makeup are done. Thank God. And we're going to get going. So the first thing we're going to get done today is we're actually going to run by KMG, which is where Zach's full studio is. But because we're on quarantine, we couldn't go without doing music. So we actually are gonna run by KMG and grab a couple more pieces of gear. We actually need a sub. But because we're on quarantine, we decided to build out our own home studio in one of our offices. So I'll show you guys kind of what that's looking like so far. Okay, so here's what it's looking like so far. We're still working on it. Um, but the biggest thing that had to happen in this room was foam <laughs> and like acoustic treatment. So this foam is literally just like off of Amazon. That was like the easiest way for us to do it since Amazon was still delivering. These are like smaller white diffusers. We've got a booth, makeshift booth for vocals and things like that. Um, and then there's still foam all around the room. Um, we're going to get a couple more um, boards up just so that we can have a little bit better treatment. This is a keyboard, a little bit of, of gear. We've got an Apollo right there. Um, but yeah, this is like our way of being able to do music from home during this crazy time. So yeah, we, uh, we love it. And being able to create and do things that we love during this time and get away from the craziness has been really fun. So yeah, this is our own little home studio. All right guys, so we're in the car now. We're going to pick up a sub and an external hard drive. Um, just need a couple things and haven't been to the facility in a long time just because of everything that's been going on and the stay at home orders and everything. But as we're in the car, I'm obviously not driving and I want to introduce you guys to Zach. So this is Zach. Hi honey bunny. How's it going? This is Zach. We've been together. How long have we been, been together, honey? Uh, it'll be five years in November. What are we going to pick up and why? Uh, we're going to pick up a subwoofer because the studio that you guys just saw is not large enough to develop low-end frequencies, so I need a subwoofer to actually hear what's going on. Zach is also an audio engineer, so he records my vocals and, and makes beats. <laughs> He's a producer as well. Um, and in the hard drive we need to get um, for Ashley making our videos, uh, she has, I don't know, what, 128 gigabyte hard drive probably on her laptop know. and it's very full. So we need, uh, we're getting a 4 terabyte hard drive and she can work off of that thing. And we don't have to have iCloud steal all of her files. Yeah, we went through this thing. We went through this thing. I'm obviously still new to YouTubing and video editing. And when I made my first video that you guys just saw yesterday, um, I had no idea how any of this works, but basically all of the video files that I needed to make the, the video that I was trying to, to compile for you guys, if I would put it on my desktop, I have the automatic iCloud feature on to where it automatically drops into iCloud um, anytime there's like a larger file on my desktop. It would constantly steal my files from me as I was trying to work on the project. So we need an external hard drive to be able to avoid that next time. But anyway. So now I got these walls Now I got these walls in my Feeling like I'm all alone, you don't seem to want me Even though you told me so And baby, I wonder if we should just go a separate ways Okay, we're at KMG. This is Zach's studio at KMG, but it's kind of torn apart right now <laughs> Because a lot of the stuff is already at our house But you can see all the acoustic treatment. We're grabbing a couple cables I think I'm gonna make a quick shake just cause it's time for a fueling for me, so. This is definitely my favorite shake they make. The silky peanut butter is the very best. This also means that uh, I'm not gonna be able to hook this up to my computer. 
Well, thank you, honey bunny. Thank you for donating your hard drive. For now. You look really sexy today. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> if you guys didn't already guess, um, Zach has a nickname of Thor because he looks like Thor. And I'm totally fine with that. <laughs> Why is it so heavy? <laughs> and that is a sub, ladies and gentlemen. So heavy. I'm glad you're doing this. <laughs> oh my god. All right. It was nice seeing ya, KMG. Okay, bye. <laughs> obviously, it's a little quiet. It's also obviously Saturday, so there's nothing going on. But with everything going on with the stay-at-home orders, we don't have any students. We don't have any classes. So we're just here by ourselves. <laughs> but yeah, that was KMG. I will give you guys a full tour when we're back in operations. We're all done at the studio. I think we're gonna make a quick stop at Whole Foods just because there's a couple things we need there. I don't do all my shopping at Whole Foods. I just do like specific things that we really like there. So we're gonna stop at Whole Foods on the way home and we will take you guys along. your body on the kitchen table and move the dishes to the side uh, yeah. girl you always tend to drive me crazy this is like the best popcorn there is it's so good okay so this is our favorite coffee which one do we get we get this one Get this organic breakfast blend. It's so good. And we fill our own bag. All of the coffee. It smells so good. Okay, so this is the best dressing, and you guys need to try this. It's like still kind of creamy, but it's tangy as well, and it's so good. We put it on salads and also just like on plain veggies. It's so good. Ah, these. Okay, so these are what I was told to try via Greg Kimball. He told me these taste like Reese's Puffs, like the cereal Reese's Puffs, and they're made of chickpeas. So we're gonna try these out and see if they're good. Greg Kimball, I'm looking at you. I'm gonna try them. You got something on your mind. I'm gonna try to help you let it go. So we're done at Whole Foods and we just stopped to get gas. And I don't know about you, but we haven't gotten gas in a long time. And Zach just told me how much is gas right now? Unleaded is 156 and premium is two bucks a gallon. So go get gas right now. <laughs> okay guys, so we are back home. I actually wanted to do some baking today because I found the Sweet Lorenz cookies. I have heard so many good things about these from all of the other YouTubers I follow and I finally found them at the store. And right when I found them, had to buy them, especially with all of the craziness going on at the stores. I was like, these are mine. So anyway, these are the Sweet Lorenz cookies. I chose the chocolate chunk. It says crafted with only clean ingredients, gluten-free, dairy-free, vegan, peanut, I don't, all of these really great things. Um, it's supposed to just be all really good ingredients. And yeah, I'm gonna see if they taste that good since they are supposedly on the healthier side and we'll try them out. So I'll let you guys know. Okay, so here's what the packaging look, looks like in case you guys wanna go grab them at the store. They sell them at Target, but I actually found them at King Supers, which is a Colorado grocery store. If you wanna see the nutrition facts, all of that fun stuff, go ahead and screenshot. But yeah, let's get started. The oven is preheating at 325, and then I just lined my cookie sheet right here. 
and spread them all out about two inches apart. You can see they're a little different consistency than normal cookie dough, so we'll see. Okay, so these are gonna go in for 11 to 13 minutes. That's what it said for like the softer kind of cookie dough. And we'll see how they turn out. Okay guys, so the cookies are done and I'm doing this for a second time because the last shot that I just did of our taste test, I'm cut out of it and you're gonna see it in a second because I'm not gonna taste test these again. By the way, they're bomb. But I will say I took them out of the oven and let them cool for like probably five or six minutes. And that's what the package said to do because when they initially came out, they were really fluffy and it didn't seem like they were done, but it said to let them sit so that they continue cooking on the tray, which I thought was interesting. So I let them sit for like five or six minutes. They hardened on the top, but they were still soft and gooey on the inside and it was so good. So roll the next clip and you're gonna see our taste test of how bomb these are. <laughs> this one's right. Okay, you eat that one. I'm gonna eat this one. You have to stay in the shop. Okay, ready? Cheers. Okay. What do you think? It's a pretty good cookie. I feel like they're pretty good. I mean, they're all clean ingredients and everything. Delightful. You can make those anytime you want. <laughs> Perfect. All right, guys, well, that's gonna wrap it up for today's vlog. I just wanted to thank you all for coming to check out this video. Also, I wanted to make sure I let you guys know thank you so much for all of your support on my very first video, all of the new subscribers, everybody just sending me positive vibes yesterday when all of this went live. Yesterday, Friday was when we made the huge announcement. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all of you being here and showing your love. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here, but make sure you subscribe to my channel, tick the notification bell at the top to make sure you see all of my upcoming uploads. Please like this video. Be sure to comment below if you end up trying the Sweet Lorenz cookies because they are bomb. But I just appreciate you guys all being here and supporting me on this journey and I will talk to you soon. Bye guys.